some very cute names. My name is Pedro, and I'm so excited to be here with all of you. And I'm just so ready to start this journey and build this community with all of you. And um, I want you to like, subscribe, and share the video if you can. And we're going to do an unboxing today. I'm so excited. So let's check out and we will see what we have. It is a box from Email Couture by Max Estrada. This is one of his mystery scoops. So this one was $20. And this was one of his mystery scoops that he has on his website. So here is the actual, you know, kit and what came in it. You see the first, you have a few bags of mail and then a bunch of other stuff. So let's just start off with this first and then we'll move on. So first, we have here the Honey Peach Coffin. I've got a one, two, three, go soft gel nail extension by Email Couture. Got the info right there. So let's open this package up and let's see. I usually always go for the lowest number, which is usually zero. And that'll be for my thumb. Having a little trouble opening that up. Oh, child. I'm sorry. These nails are something to get used to. Alright, so there you see it. That's the coffin. So, let me get my cute little dish. Get my nice little plate there. My little display area. And look, mira. Mira que cute. That's a cute nail. That's cute. I love that shade. Let's put this on here. Um, I usually like doing this just to see how long the nail is compared to what I'm wearing. Just so I can be like, all right, yeah, I can handle these or, yeah, this ain't nothing. All right, so let's put this one away. Put that back in there. You can just put that back in there. All right. Second bag, we got round of the one, two, three, go soft gel nail extensions, and these seem to be long. So let's open up this bag, pull out our trusted number zero, aka the biggest one in the bunch. The higher the number goes, the smaller the nail. So. Higher numbers are typically used for the pinkies or so. So there's a nail, looking nice and round. It's nice, I've never used this shape before. So here it looks over my coffin nail that I have now. It's a good, it's a good length and the quality of them is very nice. So let's put that big, oh, and drop it. See, I'm clumsy. I'm mess sometimes, y'all. But just bear with me, you know. This is my first video that I'm really doing. I'm nervous. I'm sweating. Child, it's a mess. But anyway, okay. Third bag, we got the Eternal Beige Almond. What the one, two, three go, but it's off the gel nail extensions. And these, I believe, I mean, these are more stiletto to me. You know, when it's a pointy shape at the top, it's more stiletto, and the rounder shape is more almond. So, to me, these are stilettos. So, let's take this one out. That trusty is zero. Pop that on me. Yeah, pop it here. Just like that. Put that up to the All right. So, right there on my nice little plate. Look at that. That's nice. That's pretty. That's a nice shape. What I like about these is that they actually all fit my nail. <laughs> you know, hey, being a guy sometimes, I mean, anybody really, anybody can have wide nail beds. But, you know, I've had a lot of issues in the past with a lot of ones from Amazon and things like that. So it's been trial and error. So I'm happy that these actually fit. So let's try. Put that next to the I think there's one more. And these, child. Let me tell you, 
I like these. These are the 24 carat almond stiletto. Let's get rid. And it's the one, two, three, go gel, soft gel extensions. These are so cute. First of all, the gold tint, the glitter, the shine, the sparkle. These are nice. Look at that. That is nice. I think this is my favorite out of the bunch that I got today. I really, really like this one. Okay. She long, girl. She long and she sharp. Mm -hmm, these claws. These gonna be some 24 karat claws. All right. All right, so I'm gonna dump out this whole bag just show you all of them, you know, how they look for the most part. And just flip them over just so you can see all the numbers. Um, these go from a size zero to 11. So we got plenty of different sizes to go from. This is the smallest out of the bags. So this one is good for very tiny pinkies. So I'm just gonna take this one out just so I can you know, compare. I cannot get the, these things are so small. I think I threw a brick at it at this point to open the bag. All right, there it is. So that's the nail. Oh, I cannot. Look how small that little nail is. Look how tiny that is. Look, hold on. Look. Look, 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 look. Look. It don't even fit on half my nail, so. <laughs> There's definitely four um, sizes for everybody, which I love. Let's get all these back together and put them back in the bag. Keep everything organized. I'm a little anal about like that. You know, I like to keep everything together. Alright, so I'm just getting everything all together and I'm going to just show you guys the bags again. I like to seal everything because especially with those little bags, they just fall out of nowhere. So as you see, we got one, two, three. And let's just switch that one over here. We got four. Four bags of nail tips, y'all. That is great. All right, so now let's continue. Now, what are we gonna do with all those nail tips? Child, they gave us a storage container. Now, it is a single storage container. Um, so maybe you can just put all the different sizes and all the different, you know, designs in there. Or, I don't know, just order a bunch of these. But I'm glad it came with at least one. Because we can at least organize one. Most likely the 24 carats, child. It was beautiful. But actually, that um, idea of putting the multiples in there, since it's just me using them pretty much, part, you know, my husband might use it, but, you know, at least it'll be, a, you know, all the same numbers will be in the same slot. So that might be good. Oh my God, does anybody like you popping those? I love popping those things. When I was a kid, I used to look, the bigger the better. That's what she said. Anyway, moving forward. <laughs> All right, so look, we got a bottle of monomer from Enel Couture. Got that cute purplish, pinkish liquid. Four ounces, 120 mLs. Now the bottle does look a little empty. But I believe this is just to protect it from any leakage or damage while shipping. Now the next thing we have here, we got some acrylic. This is the acrylic system. And 
is all the information in the back about Maxis Toronto. Uh huh. Look at me, my Vanna White. Eternal beige. Oops, my light died. Hold on. All right, I'm back. Lights on. Eternal beige. All right, so we're going to check this out. I love when acrylics come with this little tabbed plastic thing. It is amazing. It does not spill anywhere. Now, this powder is so fine. Look at the way it just coated that nail and just settles. Tap, tap, tap. Yes. That's beautiful. I'll seal that up right now. Right, we got some Lux brush wipes, 50 sheets per box. So these are used to wipe your brush. You know, whether you're doing nail art, um, acrylic, anything like that. They're so soft, they have some texture to them though. So they're great for wiping up and cleaning your brushes. And it comes with 50, so that's a good amount. And they, they're actually kind of thick too, so they'll be pretty absorbent. Ooh, here was this, the gummy jelly. Ooh, I love this bottle. This little, this container. It looked like a little cauldron, like a little pink cauldron. It's so cute. So this is the gummy jelly. So from my understanding, this is a blue gel that cures under UV LED light and you use it more for the type of chunky bling or rhinestones um, that you might apply on your nail so it's not as thin as like let's say a nail glue or any other type of adhe adhesive that you would use typically. So I took a little swatch stick just so you can see the texture. It's kind of like a Vaseline kind of consistency. And you would just apply that on the nail and then apply your crystals or rhinestones. Specifically, I believe this was made for the ones that do not have a flat back to them so you know if you have a, a crystal or a rhinestone that has a pointed back that would be perfect for it all right next we have some bling may that get cute oh, let me try to rip it mm -mm. no that's not gonna work hold on give me one second Espérate un momentico. Oh, wait a moment, please. I got my scissors. Look at these scissors, though. Ain't they nice? They cute. I got them off to me. It was like a dollar something. All right. Yes. Look at that. So a lot of his bling actually is not flat back. So I'm gonna pour this out just to see. Oh, dang, okay. So I did not know it had all these little tiny, tiny little granules in there. Look at all that. Everything else beautiful. The colors, nice, pretty, but dang. So let's pour this back, see, you know, see if I can do it. See, this is why I can't get have nothing nice. <laughs> look at this mess I made. Look at look at this. All right, I'm back. I cleaned everything, as you can see. <laughs> that is back there. Nicely, we're gonna take some tweezers. And let's use some nice little tweezers so we can see what we have in there. Well, here we are. Right now, Very the cute. I think I was over it at this point. I was like, you know what? I'm just going to close this because I don't need to pick up nothing. 
I don't need to dump nothing out anymore. Like, let's just keep it trucking. All right, so we got some more bling, number 86. This one does not need the scissors. So we're just gonna pop that open. Mm. It says Max. Okay. Look at that. From the outside, I can see we got some pearls and some gold. I don't know what it is. But let's see. Okay. Look at. Ooh, look at that stone. She cute. That's my birthstone, basically. I, mean, I was born in April, so I have a diamond. Stoner. We have some cuticle cups in there. Uh, it's a nice little pearl. Look at me trying to pick up a cuticle cuff. Right, look at that tiny little thing. Child, I'm gonna have to widen that thing so much just so it can cuff my cuticle. <laughs> That's cute though. All right, so let's, let's let's put the cap on this one. I learned my lesson. I'm not gonna dump anything else out. All right, number 85. Same easy open packaging. No scissors needed. Okay, we only got some more gold. Let's see, let's open the. Oh, oh, my pearls, literally, my pearls. Look at these holographic crystals. Oh, that shine, that, look at that purple effect. Oh, that, that round one is nice. That's pretty. Yeah, that's nice. And there's some more cuticle cups in there. All right, this one says fashion jewelry, and this is some caviar beads in gold, and actually it's in multiple sizes. And then press the scissors again. This is a work great too. Like, that was a good deal. Look at those. Look at them caviar beads. Uh -huh. You was what? Rich. Caviar gold, honey. All right, we got number 87. Y'all hear that? That's the nail. All right, Max, what else is in here? I feel like this is more of a, a little cute Hawaii little thing. I can't grab for nothing for my life. Along with my shaking, Lord. Uh -uh. So this is like a, like a tortoise shell, little teardrop. It looked like a little bam, like one of them, like a mini bamboo earring, like from the '90s. You know what I'm talking about? The ones that were like made out of plastic, cute little bow, clear. And we got. Uh, I'm trying to pick it up to so show y'all little flowers. So for this. I would apply it with that gummy gel and maybe put it some caviar beads or a pearl inside. That might be cute. That might be nice. These are such interesting shapes. We got, we got a cross. Yes. Religious tea. These are so cute. So these are all the ones that I got in this box. Good amount of bling, y'all. This is awesome. All right, next we got foils. All right, so let's see. This is the first box of foils. I can see that we have some cool, uh, whole colors, full colors. Full cover, color. Foils. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna open one up just so we can see. 
So you see some foils, you'll use some um, foil glue, which I actually have ordered from Max. So, you know, you do something like that, apply it, you'll varnish it with a silicone tool or something similar on the nail, and that color will attach on the nail. It's pretty cool. I personally haven't done it, but I'm excited to try it. These are, now, these are cute. These are lace and they're gold. Ooh, honey, look at it. That's nice. That'll look real cute on a simple, like a solid black nail maybe. Put that on, have you looking real fancy. Okay, so let's see the next one. This is, let me look at another one here. These are really nice, these lace ones. So I've got those two. All right. Now we got some stickers. So we got two sticker sets that came. So let's open it up just so we can get a really good view of these stickers, y'all. And I wanna get a feel for them too. So it says Charm Nail Stickers. Ooh, they, let's go. Okay, so these are the stickers. They are so cute and colorful. Look at that, they are so nice. I love the colors, I love the shapes. Yeah, it says hope, love, faith. Oh, those are so nice. Oh, is that the Harry Potter triangle on there? What was that called? The Deathly Hallows. Yeah, I remember that. All right, so we're gonna open up the second one. I wanna see what else we got here. So this next set is actually adorable too. My hubby had to point out to me actually because I was like, are these just photos? Like, But he's like, these are old time photos. You got poor little roids. So super cute. So nice long nail. I think that would look adorable. Oh, and now we also got some polishes. I got a liner and a gel polish. Look at that beautiful blue color. And this is a 005 Super Rich Gel Liner. Hold on, I'm gonna get my swatch sticks because we gotta check this out. I, I like the lights. Um, the little in here? to do my swatches. I always do a quick little shake sometimes. Not every time, but you know, you know, no. things might need a little recon. Hey, that got me. Look at that blue. Oh, that formula looks so Penny. nice. Penny. Now, please mind me on this camera, please, because this is my first time doing it on camera. I promise I apply polish a lot better than this. <laughs> Down! I promise you. It goes on so smooth. Let me tell you. It is creamy, smooth, very good coverage. Like, look at that. Ain't no streaking. It's soft levels. It's beautiful. I love this color. So let's just do a little sort of second coat we're gonna color in the back of our swatch to give us the appearance of a second coat let's see let's see let's see let's see okay okay oh i could see that that's cute we got summer and spring a spring and summer coming up Yes, I see some nails coming up with that. That's a nice cute color. 
All right. So this is my actually first time trying any liner. So I have never ever used a liner before. Never used a liner brush. So let's see. Uh, I'm not very good at nail art. <laughs> so let's see. I'm just gonna try and do a little simple little line. Let's see. I look up the brush a little bit. That shimmer is pretty though. That is nice. I don't know about y'all, but I love me some silver. I personally love a silver glitter over a gold. I love me some silver. Look at that shine. Mm. Yes. So, in case y'all were wondering, this is the, you know, first t official video as we're, you know, watching me try to do some sort of something on the nail. You know, we came up with the name Very Cute Nails because my husband and I, we are two bears. Um, we are part of the LGBT community. Um, and we usually for some reason when we you know we're both hispanic as well so you know when hispanics try to talk english sometimes when they're trying to pronounce a v comes out as a b so we try to do berry q like as a short for cute and the nails and the z because you know what we can so look i'm gonna put all this stuff on here Look at all this stuff that we got. I'm just gonna put everything in there. Are the foils, the gummy jelly, the et elect uh, eternal beige acrylic, the liner, the gel polish. Oh my god. What else we got? Come on, Vanna. Come on, Vanna. We got the bling. We got the two sticker sheets. We got the Lux brush wipes. Look at me trying to get everything in the frame. And then we got the four bags of nails, y'all. Now let me tell you, twenty dollars for all this? For all this? One bottle, one bottle of that size of gel polish, which is fifteen mLs, by the way, um, I believe, is normally between 13 to 20 dollars depending on the brand so oh and i forgot we got this beautiful box as well i couldn't fit it in the frame obviously but you know we got that and all this oh it's amazing now look at this beautiful I just i'm so happy that we got this set everything came out so awesome and I'm excited. I actually ordered another set, another mystery scoop. So that one did arrive already. So I already filmed that video too. So I'm so excited to show you guys the next video. You know, this is my really first time doing this YouTube channel, trying to grow a community of people that are like-minded and enjoy something. I feel like it's really something I need to be a part of and I'm looking forward to it and I've actually already have met some wonderful people. So please follow Barry Q Nails with a Z, B-E-A-R-Y-Q-N-A-I-L-Z on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, and on here. Please like the video, subscribe, and ring the bell notification.